Break the Sound started, uh, we were, me and Aaron have been friends for a really long time, and uh, in, uh, when we were freshmen in high school, we like were hanging out one night, and we decided to make a little acoustic band, and we called it Out of Impulse, and um, it was a complete joke, we were horrible, and um, we stopped doing that, and then a few months went by, and uh I wrote some new material and stuff like that, and we like sat down and we were just like, "Hey, like, let's let's do this band for real. Like, I'm not joking anymore. Like, let's really try it." And we were still really bad, but um, it was fun. And um, after a while, we got um, like picked up by management and stuff, and then slowly started forming into a full band with like drummers and keyboard players and a bassist and stuff. And then um, that's where we are today. Yeah. It was super cool. Like, I like recently when it came out, like my mom was like, "Go out and buy like like five copies." So uh, I went out and bunch of bought a bunch, and um, it's just really cool. Like my friends wa uh, read the magazine, and whatnot, and I don't know. Uh, we played a show with Johnny Craig, who's actually on the cover, and uh, my girlfriend like super likes him. And uh, when I went, she didn't get to go unfortunately, but I had him sign the cover and me and Matt signed where we were. It's just, it's just cool to like, be in the magazine. Yeah, it was fun. I think for me, I miss like, um, like the simplicity of being a duo because it was really easy since me and Aaron were already friends. We were just like, hey, you want to practice? Sure. Or like, hey, like, I wrote a new song. Like, let me teach it to you and stuff. Like, it was really simple. And like, it was never like a conflict with like, you know, schedules and stuff. But we were, like, always missing, like, the huge, like, live band, like, feel to it. Like, we can we can keep, like, the energy going pretty well for a while. But, like, with bigger crowds and stuff, we kind of need, you know, like, the full band vibe. So, I mean, that's, that's pretty much what decided us to really go out and try to make it. But I, I do miss the simplicity of it. But I love all the guys in our band. And uh, it's definitely taken us to places we probably couldn't have gotten just being acoustic. I agree with that. But you said that very well. I, I really like like Owl City, Never Shout Never, um, and we t we take a lot of our stuff from uh, like Taking Back Sunday stuff like that. We and uh, maybe Bright Eyes. You like Bright Eyes? I like Bright Eyes. We we just like like soft like really uh, chill acoustic kind of stuff. Um, yeah, I, I really I really like that kind of stuff. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it was fun. It was really cool to. Uh, just be in their presence and uh, be treated uh, by the venue like them, and it was really cool to hang out with. We hung out with Hayden and with Taylor and saw Chris for a little bit. It was pretty cool. Yeah, it was a, it was a lot of fun. It was definitely like um, it, it was all it was it was really cool, but it was borderline like a tease because for that one night we were treated like you know like like part of the you know the touring bands and stuff like that. We were there to play with them and stuff like that, and so. It was really cool to be treated as like an equal to like these people who are a hundred times better than us. But it was it was somewhat a tease because they got to leave to go to the next city, and we went back home and got ready for school. <laughs> I, I, the e. I think it's cute without yeah, the you. E I take back Sunday. I really like Seven Years by Sayosin too. That's a good yeah, one. Yeah, they're both some fun songs. Yeah. It was cool. Uh, we were just like on the side of the side of the street in our hometown, and we were just, you know, shooting the video. And uh, uh, if you've seen it, we do like an outdoor scene where um, it's we're trying to like raise money for our show. And people really thought that's what we were trying to do, so they'd stop in their cars and like give us money. And uh, it was cool. We we just hung out. How many hours of shooting do you think that was? It, it was a one full day of shooting. We started around probably like nine o'clock in the morning. It it's kind of sucked. The original plan we had was like go out to this town, um, Berkeley and like San Francisco and stuff. And, um, it was pouring rain in, uh, over in Berkeley and stuff. So we, we had to find like a location, like super quick in the morning, like me and, um, the director of the video, David, like jumped in the car and like drove around town and just tried to find somewhere we could shoot it like around because we, we wanted to get the shooting done that day. And, um, we found a place luckily that was about 10 15 minutes from our houses and uh shot from like nine o'clock and i think we we did a wrap right around 10 o'clock and um so it was one full day but it was a it was a lot of fun it was a cool first experience how, all right how, how about we do this matt says a band 
then I'll say band, and it'll go back and forth. So there'll be like, like four bands. Yeah, four bands. There you go. So I'll start off. Let's go for it. I'll say um, all time low. Time low. Um, I would love to play with We the Kings. That'd be fun. Alright. Okay. Jack John. <laughs> Jack Johnson. Um, I would say. Uh, Maybe I think Bright Eyes. Does that fool just seems like he can get down? He yeah. seems like he would be crazy to be yeah. around and stuff. And never shot never, of course. Yeah, that never was shot never, yeah. But that has to. There's one person in this band that writes lyrics, and it is Matt. He literally just like he pumps out a song all the time, and it's always like super good. But uh, truly passionate kid right here. You're looking at him. Um, yeah, I mean, we, we definitely want to, but, like, as of right now, um, like, we're still working out the kinks as, like, Break the Silence as a band, just, like, with us, because we're still new to, like, the full band vibe and stuff like that, and, um... Is she asking if we're gonna make a new album? A uh, full length. Oh. And, um, and so, like, we're, we're going into the studio, we're doing a post-production, or, I mean, pre-production session on next Saturday with our producer and our manager to work out, um the songs we're going to do for our uh, upcoming EP, but I think after this EP, we're going to put out maybe like a single around Christmas time, and then maybe one more single later in the spring, and then by next summer, hopefully jump in to, um, to do a full length yeah. or for our first one. I'm more excited to do the next EP. That's going to be really cool. Yeah, it'll be fun. Uh, yeah, we, we're, we're shooting for um, next month, uh, maybe end of the summer. Uh, we're still getting it worked out. We're actually getting it booked right now, but we plan on doing a, a little tour um, around the Bay Area. It seems like you know exactly who you want to be, but baby, I came to the same for me. I know it sounds a little crazy, but you know and I know, but that's just how I am, so close your eyes. And baby, just take my She's sweet every day of the week And she knows exactly where I'm weak And those three words I said to you Through hell and back I'll always love you That made me dare that I could do something better with myself Join down, stoke out This isn't the time to think it's outside Think I 